Shot fired at a group of protesters after a heated and controversial speech by white nationalist Richard Spencer. Spencer spoke at the University of Florida yesterday, triggering national attention and security for more than a thousand members of law enforcement. At around 5.30 yesterday, as many of the demonstrators were heading home, police say these three men fired at a group of anti-Spencer protesters near a bus stop on 34th Street and Archer Road. Fortunately, no one was hit. Channel 4's Vic Michelucci shows us what happened from Gainesville. Police say the two groups got into an argument at the CVS pharmacy across the street. The protesters walked away. The Richard Spencer supporters then got into their Jeep and drove around the corner, firing that one shot. You can see where the bullet landed in this brick wall, narrowly missing the protesters. An act of hate, that's what many people believe triggered the attack on this group of protesters across the street from UF's campus. People from outside of our community came to create violence and disruption. They came to bring hate to our city. It happened during rush hour at this busy intersection. Police arrested these three men, all from Texas, a few hours later, stopping them 20 miles north of Gainesville with help from agencies like the FBI and an off-duty Alachua County Sheriff's deputy. It helped that a protester got the Jeep's tag number as well as a description of the vehicle and the shooter. I am simply amazed that someone that had just been shot at was brave enough and calm enough to get that information to law enforcement immediately. Detectives identified Tyler Tenbrink as the shooter, telling us brothers Colt and William Fears were in the car ordering him to kill the protesters. We spoke with Tenbrink before the shooting. How more of a despicable creature could you be than someone who is ashamed and feels sorry for the color of their skin? He and accomplice Colt Fears made it clear they supported white nationalist Richard Spencer. Like people shove these agendas in my face. We also found these pictures showing the men in the middle of a scuffle on campus. Now they're in big trouble. Those three men all at the Alachua County Jail tonight as far as the protesters who were shot at. Police tell me they are not releasing their names for their own safety. In Gainesville, Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.